let's have a look at uh, the traffic um, traffic controller see if we can apply a finite state machine to it um, so we have this intersection here and then the car is coming and then we have the lights so here is northbound, southbound, eastbound, westbound. Um, for the IOs, for the IOs, um, these are the IOs we have. So northbound red light, yellow, green. Southbound, red, yellow, green light, crosswalk, light, eastbound, and the inputs, pressure sensors. We're not gonna work with this one now. We're not gonna do our adaptive control just now because we're trying to do a more finite state machine and not a mealy finite state machine. Um, so if we look back on We look back here. Gonna define these. Each red light or each light is this. So NRL is your northbound red light, northbound yellow, northbound green, southbound red, southbound yellow, and so on. This is your north south crosswalk request or um, crosswalk push button and uh, your east-west crosswalk push button so all these are the outputs and these ones here are the inputs so what I've done is gone ahead and defined some states how we want this system to work so we're gonna start it out in a north-south go so heading north heading south green light on these and these are the lights that we need to be set. We need a northbound green light, southbound green light, eastbound red light, westbound red light. And we're gonna keep this for 15 seconds before we transition over. So north, before we transition from north south green, north south go to north south wait. And the north south wait we need to set these lights here the amber light in the north and the south and keep the red lights on in the east and the west um, keep that for another five seconds then we transition to uh, just a short transition to all reds to clear the intersection so in this north south reds I've called it here so all the red lights are on north red light south red light east red light west red light here i have it um, written down as two seconds to transition to east west go but uh, i think i'm probably gonna drop this down to a second then we transition here to your east west go so we need north red south red east green west green Wait another 15 seconds, transition to wait. Reds in the north and south, amber in the east and west. Another 5 seconds, we transition over to all red lights again to clear the intersection. So all northbound, red, southbound, eastbound and westbound red lights are on. Then we'll do this another second of all reds before we go back to your north south go. And the process starts all over again so um, we're gonna try and implement this more finite state machine using ladder logic
minimize that. Minimize that. So I've gone ahead and um, define all my states here. Uh, now it's all go. Which was the first one we had. Sorry, let's bring it down a bit. So in, in this routine for your north south go, I've uh, taken I've put all the lights in there and I've been using just latch and unlatch instructions. Near north south go. As we said, you want to have your uh, want to have your north green light. So north green light is latched. You see, I have it defined here twice, but hmm, I can get rid of one of those. Your north green light is latched. Um, yellow unlatched. Red unlatched, green in the south direction unlatched, or is latched, sorry, and your yellow and red in the south direction is unlatched. In your east and west, both your green and your amber are unlatched, and your red are latched in both east and west direction, as we had there. Then we transition over to the weight. Uh, not so weight. And it's like we have here. So we've unlatched the, the green, latched the yellow, unlatched the red in the north direction. Same thing in the south. In the east and in the west, the green is unlatched, your amber is unlatched, and your red stays latched. And uh, all right, so all stop, everything stop. So we need all the red lights on. So if you look here, all the red lights are latched north, south, east, and west. It's all latched. And uh, the same thing is true um, if you go east to west when you make that transition. Let's just go east, west, go which is what we would have transitioned to next. So you see um, we have the red latched in both the north and the south direction and your greens latched in your east and your west direction. Now we could have used um, we could have used one timer and this uh, do a sum total of the time and then compare the time. So yeah, um, time is equal to 15 seconds. Then we jump over equal to 20. Then we would come here. 21 go there. 36 go here. 41 go here and 42 go about there. And then reset it and go again. We could have done that, but um, for this one I have used. Just different timers and cascade them. This one here, I, I have a routine that catches uh, a call, a call on your your crosswalk. So a crosswalk request, I uh, have a routine that catches that and then put that light, the crosswalk light, on at the appropriate time. But uh, We'll look more at the, the main routine. So the main routine here, um, timers that I have defined. See the first one, as long as this timer, the last one here, isn't done, then start this timer. 
I've changed up the time here. I've given it uh, 17 seconds here, three here, and one here. So for 17 seconds, we're gonna stay in in our south goal. See where jumping, jumping uh, to north south goal when this timer is timing. When it's time and we jump into the subroutine, which is a not so not so go, which we looked at. Okay, when this timer is done, then we do the transition start. This other timer here. This would have jumped over to this um, routine when this timer is done. Um, because this time I started and, and, and it's timing, it jumps into this routine here. This is your not so weight. When that timer is done, then this timer here starts and it jumps over into this routine. So When this one is done, it starts this timer, jump into your not so reds. And the same thing goes on for your east, west lights. Let's try and give it a run and uh, see what it looks like. You can see when you do the request, um, it comes up when the light changes. But your lights are transitioning pretty, pretty good there. If you look here, you can see we're going through the routines. This guy here has got a walk thing. Right here, you can see it. Obviously this guy is going to turn this way. Well, just a, a simple um, finite state, nothing um, overly complex, but just the way you can implement finite state machines in uh, ladder logic.